Oh yeah guys, another Speed 6 video. What is up guys, this is 5 things I love about my Mazda Speed 6. Now I know you guys want to see a poll in this thing and the reason why I haven't been able to do a poll is because my tuner hasn't sent me the tune, which is coming tomorrow. And I don't want to do polls on a base map because I just barely got this thing. I'm not really trying to explode it. So this video is going to be five things I love about my Speed 6. And then tomorrow we'll get some actual polls in. But the first thing is the turbo. This is a 6262 Precision Turbo. And this thing is freaking sweet. I thought it was going to spool way slower before. I thought it was going to spool like you know, significantly slower than my 5858 that I had, but it almost seems identical. It almost seems like the size difference really is negligible between the 5858 and the 6262, even though it's quite a bit bigger in horsepower rating. So this thing was making boost, is making about 20 PSI the one time I, you know, kind of got into it by about 45, 5,000 RPM. 5,000 RPM is when it really was starting to wake up, but I thought it was gonna be more like 7,000 RPM, you know, all the way at red line. I thought that's when this thing was really gonna start pulling. So I'm excited to see how hard it does pull at red line, but that is the number one thing I love about this Mazda Speed 6 that I've bought is the huge turbo on it and the whole turbo setup. Now the second thing is this intercooler setup. As you guys know, this water to air intercooler is pretty unique. Not a lot of people have used this, and I have a suspicion that this is another reason why the turbo spools so freaking fast is because the short, the shorter piping right here, it's got shorter piping and then obviously, you know, right down here, it goes directly into it. So this is basically all the intercooler is rather than having a front mount intercooler that would go down below. So I think that's another reason why it spools so fast and I'm extremely excited to see on the access port because I'll plug in my access port tomorrow when I have my tune, but I'm excited to see how much of a difference it actually makes. Now for number three, let's get in here. And as you guys can see, this shift knob right here is pretty freaking sweet. And this is not normally something I would personally love, but this pairing shift knob right here is actually incredible. It has one of the best feeling shift knobs I've ever had. Like you can grab it up top, you can grab it in the middle. This is an amazing shift knob and I'm kind of surprised it came with the car. I would have taken that thing off so fast. That thing is sick. So I'm actually super surprised I got such a cool shift knob, but that is another thing that I love about this car. Now going to number four, it's the old tail lights. Now these tail lights are aftermarket. I'm not really sure what they're called, but I know for a fact they're not stock. And man, they look 10 times better. I normally am not a lights guy or aftermarket tail light guy or anything like that. But the fact that they look so much better makes me kind of want to keep them, you know? They look 10 times better though than I thought it would. So I'm pretty stoked on these tail lights and I'm excited. I think I'm going to tint them or something black. So I'm excited to see how they would look just blacked out and then, you know, the LEDs underneath or whatever. But let me know if you guys have seen those tail lights before or if you know what brand they are because they're pretty sweet, but the final thing that I love about this Mazda Speed 6 that I just got, I just picked up, are actually the old wheels. Now, if someone could tell me if these are legit BBS or not, I seriously doubt they're BBS, but of course it has the BBS logo on it. I'm pretty sure they're just eBay knockoffs or something, but they're definitely better than stock, I think. And I kind of like the look of them. I feel like if they were powder coated a cool color or if they were powder coated black in general, they might look way better, but that's the fifth thing I love about this car that I just picked up. I picked this thing up for a ridiculous price and I am super, super excited on it, but I just wanted to get this video out to you guys to show you a little bit more over the Speed 6, but you'll have to let me know what you guys think and let me know if you guys like the video.